Hey there, everyone! This is Alcow playing Super Sammy Roll. <laughs> Maybe today we'll escape one level videos? I don't know. Uh, interesting thought in the spawn zone. As a reflection of how I said about this level, learning it felt really bad, but once I actually knew what to do, things started feeling like it was genuinely good and genuinely fun. So, Storm Clan Bushi Fortress. So, it feels like this game is the sort of game that is like this oh okay we got lightning now it's sort of designed with the idea that you would master it it's a game intended for mastery and i respect that i just think it's a little silly because in order to get to the part where you can master it like you need you need to be able to play it like you need to have some method of enjoying things a little bit Whoa, okay wouldn't let me chew until I was too far away. So there, I I, I didn't know. I, I went just too early. I didn't stop. Yeah, it's basically just hurt block. That's fine. We know what those are. I wonder if this is... Whoa, that is a fancy move there, Mr. Samurai. So wait for the lightning to strike and then go. Faster than lightning, a little bit. Everything's so wet. Just my floating blocks are so wet. Okay, so here we are, press a button that I can see. Time is getting a little short, but that's going to be okay, maybe. So we do a little bit of that, just internalize the timing. It's not too hard, look at that egg, I fell into the void, oh man. And I'm gonna sit here. Do you think this is the place? Like, there's a there's a secret exit somewhere. Whose clue I was given to climb a wooden building. I don't know, this building... Wooden? Wow. Whoa! Okay, can I salvage it? Not with that mighty slash. Oh, but I'm trying to run up against the wall and die. I mean, that's the building, and I'm not seeing an exit on top there, like a golden owl. I will say that. Golden owls are an extremely visible thing. Hey, what? All right, hey, buddy. You keep on keeping. Maybe it's like behind the building. I don't know. All right, so just kind of go. Look at that guy. Sure is a guy. Oh, well, there's a raspberry at the very least. It's not a secret exit, but it's something that was hidden. No, I'm just kind of, Like, there might be other blue. Blue? Why blue? Other wooden buildings. Ooh, the Weavers! Jump over lightning and get yourself a magic sword. Coins appear in the tube you're riding. Now, let's ask for more. What are you asking here? Oh, that thing moves. Okay, that's what you're asking. I was like, wait, am I supposed to, like, co-occupy that little tile block with Brendo here? Or, uh, the answer is no. Kind of not the easiest thing in the world here. Oh, there's the owl. All right. Um, I'm going to have to assume that there's a second level... Really? With the wooden building. This is just time jump. That's all it is. It's like a not quite as coordinated security encounter here. Yeah, I, I jumped for no reason once and you can see the underside of the house. Alright, now you can forget the other one. Concentrate on this one. I jumped too early. I just I just jumped way too early. I'm you so yeah, I think I know why. It's because you know the timing of when you have to jump is going to change as I get progressively further away, right? Like that's just logic. But I was not acting like that. I was just using the exact same timing every time, which yeah, is not gonna work. When you get hurt next to a thing that can hurt, you can just get juggled like that. That never feels great. You hear it closer, gotta jump earlier. And I'm. Looks like. I feel like I'm more. Really? Wow, 
Why do I keep? Whoa! Who's that? Well, oh, I. Can you just go in the pipe? Eventually, you know, once in your lifetime, you're allowed. Uh, uh, the camera is trying very hard to be helpful, by the way. Just, dude! Whatever. Dying from a lot of, like, little incidental things, that really shouldn't kill me. Here I press a button. Okay. Oh shoot. Okay, good. And he's not even slashing at me anymore. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Alright, S plus, sure, I'll take it. This level was a lot of fun. I died a lot in little simple ways that don't feel good. See, there's room for secret on top. But I saw the wooden building. Well, we'll see. Maybe there's gonna be more wooden buildings. This level was a lot of fun. I, I died a lot, but I died in ways that, to me, make sense, for lack of a better word. Let's do another one. Spinning out of control! I might regret this. Oh boy, everyone be spinning. The turtles are spinning, the platforms are spinning, those blocks too. Everyone's going in circle now. Volcanoes away in the background. I don't know if that's the fruit. No, it's a little samurai. Whoops! Found the perfect timing to fall in the thing. It's pretty good. If these look neat. All right. Yeah. So these are these guys. There you go. That's my description for them. Cost me a lot of money to get that description. Yeah, the timing is not obvious to climb in, but once I get it, I'm gonna get it. Alright, that's my request to you. Okay, that should be good. Yeah, but like, the thing is, once you are on, the thing seems to be moving pretty much at your exact speed. So just do it, you know? You just... Ooh, reverse? Reverse might be easier to deal with, because it's just a jump in that case. I say that, but I keep hitting... The blocks themselves? Uh, just leave me be. Leave me be. Alright, this is not about- okay. Jump! Alright, ignore my inputs, that's fine. So I thought this'd be easy, but the issue is that my jump isn't very high. See, and I hit- you, you need to be- at like your height of jump. But then if I do that, I jump very far- oh man, I'm just dying, just dying, just dying, just dying, just dying, just dying. Dude. Just not go on the floor. <laughs> just do that, which is so much simpler. Like, that cannot be an oversight, right? Like, it is blatant. Okay. So that one isn't spiky. I saw a spike one day and I was like, is that spike okay? I don't know. So you can go here, then you kind of have to hang out a little bit. Jump. And then you jump. Oh, and then you find out there's a spring on the other side. Rude. 
I guess it's not impossible that the berry might be on one of these. I think the strat actually is probably to. Oh no 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 no! Is it possible to time yourself to make sure that the spring is there when you want it? I don't think it is. Because of the spikes, the way they're on here. Well, you can just wait here, though. Not comfortably? Here we go. Hey, there's a fruit. No puzzle with that fruit. The big, confident jump. Yeah, okay, you know what? I'm dead, but I'm fruited! More of a... A bounce. Right, you know how it works in this game. I'm too late. Okay. Right, no shenanigans, just... <sighs> okay, you know what? The timing on those is kind of very difficult. Oh, beautiful. I knew it wasn't that hard. I just had to, like, actually nail it. Okay. What's the best way to do this part, though? Remember, imagine you're playing Sonic the Hedgehog. What do you do? You play the level the least possible. <laughs> and even with that in mind, I feel like I've played with the level a lot. Still got an S somehow, in spite of how that went. See? This could totally have a secret exit, and this is a wooden structure, but, like, there's room for it on the map, but I don't, I, I, if there was one, I didn't see it. Okay, spinning out of control, yeah, it was not out of control, it was extremely, extremely predictable, doesn't make it any easier, but, 